So we continue our Polish Museum of Military Technology series and uh, one of the vehicles I personally really really wanted to see in real life was ZSU-57-2 which we have here and uh, there are a couple of other AA uh, vehicles, um, SPAAs I guess you can say self-propelled anti-air uh, vehicles uh, starting from like I would say the more basic one which is the ZSU 57-2 going to the Shilka which is the ZSU 23-4 scary looking thing to a radar looking I can't remember what it's called but we'll check it out so yeah this video is gonna be about these three AA uh, vehicles uh, generally about these two that I really really like They're really scary things for the time when they were made actually so we actually start from I'm gonna say the most modern one here so this is basically a BRDM2 chassis I believe uh, with a radar and some tracky ground to air missiles and this little piece of paper says that this is called Strela 1 and the NATO code for that is SA9 Gaskin. So yeah, this thing would just switch on the radar, lock onto the target and goes the rocket and see you later. So we're gonna go down that way. I suppose, yeah, we're going for the more high-tech to the less high tech but that last boy actually is the one that I'm the most excited for here comes I believe the nickname is Shilka Shulka Shilka something like that you can obviously correct me if I'm wrong I have no idea what the chassis is I believe it's purpose-built for um, this little bad boy which is the ZSU 234 and these things usually get their names from the caliber and amount of guns these things have so basically this is the ZSU which I don't know what it stands for 23 4 so the 23 is the 23 mil cannons uh, which actually I suppose you get something similar to IL-2s as well uh, and you get four of them so that's why it's 23 4 and this thing has a really good radar and this thing's fire rate is insane I don't know insert a clip from War Thunder where it fires this thing is mad you don't want to be flying anywhere near this thing and it sounds and looks and shoots just as mean as as the nickname suggests Shulk, I don't know what that means actually, but yeah, this is again a little kind of check mark which I really uh, didn't know I'm gonna see this thing, but uh, I'm happy that I am seeing it and it's really really cool. And now the one that I am personally myself the most excited about is the ZSU 57-2 and again the name comes from the 57 millimeter barrel autocannon and you got two of them so that's why it's 57.2 and for this one you can correct me if I'm wrong but I believe that's a T44 chassis uh, just taken from a T44 uh, with a purpose purpose built um, the, the top turret with the these cannons with elevation and all the other obviously mechanics that goes into making the AA so I believe this is a T44 chassis uh, with like the, this whole thing on the top and uh, yeah this thing again if you play any video games including War Thunder this thing doesn't I'm gonna say this thing is almost better of tank destroying than shooting planes but once you get your hand you know handy then then it does does the job really really well and uh, certainly did not think I would see one of these things like like in my life in real life so yeah uh, I don't know for some reason I thought like most of these things are probably destroyed but uh, here we are standing right next to it 